<laughs> oh, hello. Sorry I'm late. Big day. Big, big day. But we got the sewers to look forward to. That's nice, isn't it? Intent. Oh, man. Um... Okay. Oh yeah, I have to change this, don't I? Close. No. I guess that's this way. Right. Okay. Jeez, it's a bit dark. How's that? <laughs> Not much better, like at all. Okay. Fine. Oh, that is an exit. Which... God, oh my god, my inventory is completely full. Um, oh, shit. <laughs> Well, I guess we'll wait until we come across something actually worth picking up. Um. How do I win? How how was I winning this before? That's the gateway between here and Harish, the Valley of Dust, home of the Necromancers. Right there. And we're going straight through. Oh. Oh my god, these are actually somewhat easy to kill. Uh oh. Oh my god, I thought that was something special, but it's just the stick hadn't loaded yet. Just checking, making sure there's nothing else here. Like a little secret to something. Which of course we have to stand still to find. Uh. 
Okay, can we like, can I have two seconds to get my fucking bearings, please? No. The game was so bright to me, but not. Um. It doesn't really help much. Did I do that? I did do that. Okay. Did I do that? Somewhere there must be a key. Look for signs on the walls so we you find your Keep way. An eye out. That's uh, ominous. This place is huge. More territory to conquer, that's all. It is gigantic. Every single door is locked. And of course by every single I mean the, the last two that I've approached. Okay, that might actually be of some use in here. Which is good because it was shit last time. Oh my god. What is this guy? So little health, Jesus. That seems to be the um the way I go with a lot of these games. Um where I put a lot of points into everything other than health. <laughs> Kind of like the embodiment of a glass cannon to a ridiculous degree. Who just wouldn't die. Oh, for God's sake. Um, cool. Uh,
wonder if he just spawns there. Lightning is so slow, and it hasn't it hasn't got any more powerful. See, they can summon zombies. Why can't I? Mm, for fuck's sake. Do you have the Shadow Steel stuff? Or the Soul Reavers stuff? Maybe we can try that one. Oops. Oh, fucking hell. I st oh, God. I forgot I had this. Hit his shield and I died? See, I have one of those spiky shields. Saves it in a very, very, very shitty spot. That was lucky. seeing these guys like ever before I mean it has been a very long time since I played so there is that I 
I'm gonna have to save every time we kill one of those things. Jesus. You know, I can't say I feel like letting the ghouls out. My entire build is throw spells at them and hope they don't kill me before I run out of mana. <laughs> Kind of works, I guess, if you can get one enemy. that guy like a slave or something that adrenaline attack is supposed to be a one hit kill these guys can just tank straight through it I think that's among the, the threats that they spew out. Uh, and so far they are uh, really keeping their word on that one. The amount of times I've died so far is in 15 minutes is a little embarrassing. I mean, that, um, you know, I've never actually seen that movie. Uh, but the amount of stuff.
stuff that's that's referenced in is ridiculous. <laughs> that's about the reaction I expected. That's that's what everyone does when I when I uh, tell them that. <laughs> it's either that or I get punched in the face, spat on, you know, it's a fairly standard reaction. <laughs> it's it's I've always meant to watch it, I just never I just never got around to it. I don't know, I just never really... Yeah, I just never got around to it. I, um, I've watched... A lot of other movies with the same... With the main character guy. He was in... Men in Tights. Let's take these guys. So I quite like him. Um, but yeah, I just, I don't know. Just never, never got around to it. It's on the list. quite a few movies I haven't really seen. It's got holds up. I've heard, yeah. Um, yeah, I'll get around to it eventually. But I know, like, I know a lot of the important bits. Like, prepare uh, the whole thing. <laughs> Kill my father, prepare to die. I, that that's I'm familiar with. And the other bits and pieces. I'm <laughs> so bereft. Honestly, the rest of my family are just as uncultured and sacrilegious as I am. Kick, 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 kick. Bring popcorn and Blu-ray. God, I don't. E I don't even think anyone I know owns Blu-rays anymore. Oh fuck! Is it on Netflix or Disney or something? Ouch! Um, or uh, I guess if it comes down to it, I can buy it off. Um, the Pirate Bay. <laughs> okay, can you... Oh, fuck. That was my own fault. Oh, God. Oh, they suck. It's hard to keep track of who, of like what's, what's on what now. I don't have Netflix anymore. I got rid of it. Um, oh my god. So if it's on there then. Oh. <laughs> it does, yeah. Australia usually gets like shafted on that end, unfortunately. We tend to get a lot of the, um, I mean, I don't know why. So many of our streaming services don't have the versions that everyone else does. That was part of the reason I got rid of rid of um, Netflix was because we don't have so much of the stuff that everyone else does. But and like, no offense to anyone who likes Bollywood movies, but the sheer number of Bollywood movies on Netflix here is boggling, and I don't know why. <laughs> it's they they're so. So, so many of them, and that they don't really interest me, and they're not really a, a, a genre that I'll go out of my way to watch. There's just so many. <laughs> Can't have Lord of the Rings, but you can have just whatever Bollywood stuff is on there. They can kill me in one hit. It's ridiculous.
Was? Oh my god. There's a um, particular group. I think there's a lot of like kids in my neighborhood. Unlucky for them. Uh, there's a particular group that <laughs> I guess after school every day decide to have fucking screaming Whoa. matches. And my whole neighborhood like echoes. So this is one um, bunch that stand like a couple doors uh, houses down and just scream their fucking lungs out. My ba my basement is about to get some new additions. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Woof. There's some. It's, Kind of sounds like a banshee scream. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> oh, I can't kick you off if you're going to jump off yourself. This is my dream. I would love to have a library full of just books like this. If they were magic books, even better. Oh no, I'm out of, oh no, I'm out of potions. That's not good. A vampire knight. Cool. I mean, they suck and I hate them, but cool. What was that? Show some skill. Did I hear stop right there, or it gets ugly? This does no damage. That's a mana back though, so that's okay. Why did I think that would work? <laughs>
Good bro, you just you just gonna Well I'm getting my my mana's worth, so For God's sake. I mean... This is to like balance it because you can steal their... their mana. But good lord. Does it take a while. an hour and I probably died 30 times. Maybe maybe close to 50. Absolutely ridiculous. Dead. Good. A hook. Mm. This thing must have a purpose. Probably a magical key. They inherited their bad habits from the wizards. <laughs> mm. Didn't we work for a wizard? Mana region, 12 points. Oh my god. Making shots more accurate. That is really more quickly. The shield's probably not a terrible idea. So, I guess we just head back. There was a few doors with that, with the hole, the, I guess the orb. Ew. Please make sure to wash the area down and eliminate all residue once training is complete. Mother Superior Geralda. Ew. Gross. I mean, at least they're practicing good hygiene, but still. Shop. No. Worker. Some fucking worker. Oh my god, the one I um, possessed is doing pretty alright. Jesus Christ! Is this a 
sculpture shop? No, a workroom. If you worship death, you don't care how you learn the secrets of life. Better to be the examiner of death. Oh no, he died. <laughs> Go fuck yourself. Why? Is this a butcher shop? No, a workroom. If you worship death, you don't care how you learn the secrets of life. This must be where they make the ghouls. So I think oh. It would be nice if you could get something to make your things more effective. Like, we have the rings, but so far they haven't really helped us much. Um, like little artifacts. I'm probably asking a bit too much from a fairly old game. <laughs> Poisons. Illusion. Ah. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. Ah. Oh, that thing's moving. Gross. So I still need 14 points if I want like the, um, oh no, I need way more if I want the sword that gives us health back. I'm wondering if I'm missing something on 
with the demon. Uh, demon form. Because it can't be this shit. You're so just unreasonably squishy. secrets or anything that'd be nice <laughs> Just like a little secret spot. Shadow Steel Daggers. Can I? Can I not drop this? Excuse me. Um, why can't I drop the pickaxe? Weird. To the pit. It sounds lovely. Finally, it's coming in to be handy. I wish my spells did that much damage. I wonder if you can even do anything. No, you your main function is to run away, isn't it? Don't move. Oh, 
I feel like I'm going mad. You there. Prepare, prepare yourself for You there, demon person. Oh god, look at that animation. <laughs> it's beautiful. Although, I was kind of hoping for... ...different, um... ...the better stuff inside them. kind of bad about that but not bad enough to stop surprisingly we're making a decent progress this place is massive but we're getting there So this is where the like one choice in this game is. Uh, there's two endings, depending on your decisions. Decision. Do I have a more damaging weapon? <laughs> Probably do, hang on. This does knock them over, though, which I feel like is fairly important. So, it's a little better. Your time has come.
See, even this, this is five damage instead of two. And it's not. And it crashed. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. I like how it gives you the ending screen there. Oh, for God's sake. It's an old game. It's barely run. It took me ages to get working, so, you know, I'm going to take what you can get. Oh boy, there's a lot of men here. Oh my god, it raised up one of the the ones that have died. I didn't know they could do that. I'm like, I'm hanging on by the skin of my teeth here. Oh, not even. Curved around a fucking pillar to kill me. What is this wanted? Do you want to stuff about Bayonetta? Uh, has it been? Has it been some updates? Has there? I uh, pretty much all that I got was the um, whole four thousand dollars for the whole series thing, and that was pretty much it. I'm not sure how that's developing. Has it gotten worse or better? <laughs> should have a better time with this. Oh my god, or not. Yeah, why why is this all come out like now? So what is this is this like the fucking 
the 27th Bayonetta game. I'm not a big, I, I don't really, they're not my kind of game. But there's a whole bunch of them now. Oh, six figures and residuals, right. I mean, they're pretty big, they could probably afford it. <laughs> pretty big games from what I understand. Um... This is a different, this is a different kind, I think, this way. I mean, not enough. So, as it, is she getting her demands, or has she already voiced the game? Or is they still, are they still making it? Is it in development? I have very little knowledge on this. replacement oh my god they replaced it that quickly well that's got to piss some people off herself included i'm sure so god if they were if it <laughs> If they were that quick to find a replacement, they had to have her waiting in the wings then. There's, especially if it's, it's got to be someone who's got a similar voice, I, su I suppose. Because otherwise you've totally changed the character. Mind you. No, I mean, they... They never do. In these situations, everyone, is, everyone gets caught in the... Son of a bitch. Everyone gets caught in the crossfire, whether or not they're involved in any way, shape, or form. That's how these things go. Once, once the gloves come off, the fucking... The claws go for anyone who can... Who's within reach. Tend to see that a lot these days. With, um... These big... Like... Very public... Um, shenanigans. Um. Huh. Okay. Fucking hell. It's more expensive than Union. So, they're trying to send a message, I guess. It's, it seems like it's definitely a messy situation. I, uh, w one of the other things I saw was, um, because when it popped up, TikTok was all over it, and I just couldn't be bothered. Um, and the guy who's in charge of the whole series, um, people going after him as well. I don't, I cannot remember his name, though, but he's quite from... What I gather, he's quite a unique personality. <laughs> and the other way, right. Well, I guess, yeah. I think we're going to be seeing a lot more stuff like this um, as we go on. She, that, the other voice actor broke an NDA, which is big no no. It certainly doesn't do you any favors. So, probably it may make other people. Um, break their NDAs. That tweeted him in English. Right. Okay. <laughs> Seems. Hmm. I haven't seen him. I don't know if he's returned from Stonehelm. I mean, to be fair, I use the block button on it all social media like it's going out of fashion, so. I'll have to I'll have to look I have to look in, see if I can find a 
explanatory video. It goes in depth about all this nonsense. Where would Aaron here keep his journal? Where would we find his personal effects? I don't f probably in his room. Her again? Oh, forget her. You have to retrieve the skull. She'll just slow you down. She's still alive. We must find a way down to the pit. You don't have time for that girl. You must stop Arendt here. Spine pit. Okay. So if we rescue her, we get like the your you get the good ending, which is much less fun. Stuff on Twitter. <laughs> oh my fucking god. What is it about Twitter that oh, people just feel like, you know what? I want my terrible opinions heard. So here you go. <laughs> it certainly seems that way, doesn't it? I don't. I'm very kind of reserved on the whole social media game. But some people use it as a diary, which is, sure, fine. You want to put your thoughts out on the internet, more power to you. But if you're going to have these terrible, terrible, like transphobic or racist or anything, it's probably better off in your personal journal. Okay, if you need to get it out of your system, do it there. Not on the internet for everyone to see and then, you know, think you're <laughs> you're in the right here. I just don't, it's just, it doesn't work that way. That's, yeah. It's so, Twitter is, I mean, it's awful. Um, but it's very easy to look up what people have said on there. Like that whole James Gunn thing from years ago, where he tweeted some stuff, like, at that point, years ago then, and he got, um, rinsed for it. It's just like, fuck me. <laughs> I just, I don't, I don't get the, maybe it's how easy it is to use. Maybe that's it. You, you like, you get caught up in the heat of the moment, or you're just a terrible person. I, I probably would go with the latter. The latter one. Don't you show the world? Yeah, exactly. You're certainly certainly very brave for putting, actually no, stupid. If you're gonna go on, but in saying that, Twitter there is an audience for people like that though. So they can, that's one of the reasons I, I use Twitter to post when the stream's going live, and that is it. And I follow some artists on there, but I never really use it. There is an audience for all the terrible people, and Twitter is probably one of the worst platforms, I would say. What? He'll murder tens, hundreds of thousands. Mad man, I won't let you destroy this city. Um... Okay. So, yeah. A prong collar? What's a prong collar? Don't even know what that is. Um. Oh, is that like the when they bark, it kind of pokes them? Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm not, I'm not a huge fan. I don't. Um, yeah. I actually, I. Um, yeah, I actually used. I don't. Those electric shock collars. I think they're super cruel. I, I don't. I don't think they should be used on dogs at all. Um, but in saying that, 
I actually got myself a, an electric shock bracelet a little while ago that you can set to do um, for like bad habits and things and like I was sleeping really 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 poorly aren't you taking the long way oops sorry okay so I was using it as like an alarm and let me tell you shocking yourself fucking works <laughs> uh but again i wouldn't that was because i have the this the consciousness and also matter uh made the very conscious decision myself to be like okay i need to shock myself to get some stuff done yeah shock collars i've seen some of them used you can't really there are still places you can buy them here, but most people don't. Um, they don't recommend it. Like we had one of my puppies. He used to he used to have a really fucking intense um, barking problem, where he would just bark for hours and hours and hours straight. So we got him like a smell collar. And it would it releases a smell whenever they bark, which I'm not I don't like those either. Um, oh god! But one of the the pet shop that my parents went to get this collar, they were like, made it very clear that if <laughs> they do sell electric shock collars, but they're not really going to sell them to you, if you know what I mean. They're not super keen on letting people have these collars. Trainer. Oh, tell <laughs> yeah. Um, see, yeah, the thing is, like, with those prong ones, most people don't know how to train an animal properly. So, that's when, that's when you get the problems, when someone fucking reefs on the leash. And that's, that, issues start um, but if it's done properly then I'm, I suppose it's fine but yeah the the smell thing they were that was a waste of money they don't work at all and also the smells really pungent not probably not the best thing for it to like release this really strong smell every time you, they bark we didn't we used it for about a week before it was kind of like mm, But dogs are gonna bark. <laughs> That's the thing about dogs. I, I wasn't especially. This is when I was pretty young. I wasn't especially happy with my parents who decided to, to buy this collar for the dog. So I'm pretty sure I ended up taking it off more than not. Oh my god, there's so many. Furniture and stuff. See, that stuff. My my biggest dog, he uh, he had a chewing problem when he was a puppy. He would, oh god, yeah. But we tried that no chew spray stuff and it did not stop him. If anything, it made it worse. <laughs> He's a bit of a freak though, so could be something to do with that. It's thinking it more. <laughs> I, I there must be the like why is it spicy <laughs> thing seems to fit quite well there. Dogs are weird, as I'm sure you know. It's like uh, what are they? The, those toads that make you. I think they they make you sort of high when um, like if you lick them. And they found wild dogs would like lick them to get off their chops. <laughs> so they're into all sorts of stuff. No, don't go this way. Oh my god, this is. That's weird. 
weird puppies are the best puppies. Stay where you are, Please, go this way. You fucker. There we go. I don't know if most of my dogs have been kind of weird in some way. Now that I think about it, they've got a whole kooky bunch. Oh, there's a cage out there. Yeah. Once you, um. It's not really that hard at the end of the day. I know some dogs can be very, 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 very challenging. But at the end of the day, like, as long as you treat them okay. Yeah, I mean, treat them very well. Like, just okay. Everything usually turns out alright. This is CC paper. <laughs> oh my god. Gotta love that. Cr crunch? The crinkle, maybe? Must be, must be the texture. Certainly isn't the taste. Oh god. <laughs> it's just cruel. <laughs> As long as he's having fun, that's all that matters. Oh god. I have actually eaten, uh, ashamed to say this, but I've eaten my fair share of paper. I have memories of it as a kid just tear it into a piece of paper for no fucking reason, because apparently I was a psychopath. Oh good. Oh no, that's that's nasty. Oh, that I can't I can't get as much. Oh, oh that is actually gonna make me ill. That's gross. <laughs> Homer is a freak. <laughs> oh god. Oh. Yeah, no, I mean, if he wants, if he wants it, what, are you going to touch a used tissue with dog slobber all over it? Ugh. No thanks. He wants it that desperately. Oh, that's nasty. Although, dogs have a fucking weird fascination with the garbage, don't they? We had to put a protective, um... So we just had like a freestanding garbage bin that we had to eventually put a it was like a gap on the in, underneath the counter so we had to put like a full-on cupboard door on um and lock it too because they, our dogs used to get into the, the big one would knock the bin over and then the other um couple would get in and just rummage through everything. So it'd be three o'clock in the morning and you, and you just hear <laughs> going through all the nasty garbage. It's like living with a bunch of gremlins. Not a long day at work. Yes, we, I got here about 6.30-ish instead of 5.30. But yeah. 
they are unfortunately getting the days are getting longer it's because it's coming up to Christmas and where I'm working now they're very um, oh I guess I can tell you so I work at a university now not a, like not in the university but the fucking construction parts of it and the semester's nearly over so when the semester's finished is when all the kids leave kids um so that's when they from here on out is when they want us to get where the students usually live like their their accommodation and all that sort of stuff so i will forewarn you now there might be some long days ahead but I'll usually, I'll, I'll try and um, put in the Discord or Twitter uh, now when I'm not going to be here. I get a chance. Kids, <laughs> yeah, I know. It's hard not to. Some of them, fucking hell. I, I already feel old. Um... <laughs> anyway. Still from your package. Really? I never... My... My animals never had, like, a fascination with that stuff. My cat had a, a weird thing for my dirty work boots. I'd come home and take my boots off after work. And he would literally stick his head in. Which I don't... I still don't know how he didn't, like pass out from that because those were disgusting um tmi probably but still um and but he was the only one he was such a little weirdo he would literally he, well i mean he's still alive it's not like he's dead he, he followed me around and whenever i take my boots off he'd completely ignore me and just go straight for the, the spicy boots Oh god, I feel like I, I I I genuinely sometimes feel like I get I roll up out of bed and it's just like oh, I feel like I've I've aged about 70 years in the night. It's crazy. Who the kids they are. That's a it's a that's a thing no one really talks about. Where so I had like a, I'm 24, right? Nearly 25. And now I think back to when I was 18, or like 17, or, you know, younger. And you don't feel like a kid at that age. You son of a bitch. But my God, you are. I just think back and go, wow. And now I look at all these, these people who are the same age. And I'm like, you're just a baby. You're, you're basically a baby. I still feel like a baby. <laughs> Mentally. Um, physically, I feel like I'm 80. <laughs> it's a weird balance, isn't it? Oh, hang on. There are doors here. <laughs> it's just why I'm 90. <laughs> uh... Old souls. Oh yeah, I yeah that's true. I guess you would you would look at the the new years coming in. You'd be like, ugh, who let these toddlers in? Okay, I was literally just in there. There was no space for two people. You're a dead man. Show some. Oh my god, they're spawning inside there. Spritz for me, it is nice, yeah. Makes it very handy for me. What 
is going on? They keep swimming. Or have I, did I just kill this guy properly? You're an The opposite was true as well. You'd look at people in the, in the grades above you and be like, oh my god, they're so adult. <laughs> no. No, they really are. You still got you still got freaking uh these kids drawing dicks all over the wall and destroying the bathrooms and stuff because they just felt like it. So we're, they're not grown. Oh my god, did I ever sit and tell you that my bathroom, which I think it became a common thing, but this high school I went to, the bathroom had blue lights um, to stop people from doing drugs. <laughs> It'll be after all. Uh, this one's good because we've run out of, well, we nearly run out of H, uh, potions. And it's the only way I can get my mana back. But otherwise it takes years to kill people and it is not good at all. Um... But until we get the stockpile or that skill that lets us um, regen mana, we're kind of stuck with this thing. So they're okay. They're better than the other weapons. Guide to the arcane. I would really like... I wish these books would give you something. Not just... They're just there to read. Maybe some skill points or something. Uh, uh, no, yeah, but that is the correct response. That's fucking disgusting. Yikes. Ah, that's what Aaron Tear's journal meant. Temple now. Yeah, so we are the Antichrist, essentially. Uh, and now that is essentially it. We're trying to take over the world. Well, we're trying to stop Aaron Tier now, who's like, who was supposed to be the, the big bad, but he's not really. Oh, he is, but for different reasons. Um, and now we're trying to kill him so we can have our kingdom, essentially. Uh, but yeah, we we he's he has the skull, so we need this crystal skull thingy um, to do whatever we're going to do. And he's got it. And we need to find it. And we left Leanne, Le Leanne, what's her name? Lana. Lana. Lena. Is it Lena? Whatever it is, we just left her to get eaten by a giant spider. So we've we've secured our dark ending. I think. No, she was taken prisoner. I mean, she's dead now. She's, like, most definitely dead now. Um, you can save her and get, like, the good ending. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, poor Liana. It's just as well. She would have been shattered to see you come into your true power. It would almost have been worth <laughs> keeping her alive just to see the expression. Exactly. On her this is like face. one of the few games where yeah. you the are the bad. The only thing that matters. You are like such wisdom. The bad guy. Go far together, you can love. change that, but I like I like I like games where you can be the evil, evil one. Hello. Don't go out there. You'll leave the ghouls here. You'll get us both killed. Hey! Oh! <laughs> Yikes. Although I will say, I've done the good ending before, it's not as good. Dunk. This one is quite a survivor. Um, you do get to Why fight a giant splatter, I think. Which is kinda cool. Done for you. They're all over the city. You know a way to get through the battle to the necropolis? Not me. My cousin Percy. He knows every inch of the tunnels and sewers under the city. I told him about you, in case something happens. Okay. 
Oh, okay, so we can't use our demon form here because that'll end the mission. <laughs> Oh my god, what movie inspired Metroid? But lockpicks, yeah. It doesn't usually lead to anything decent, but I mean, we got them. <laughs> I'm I'm a big fan of the alien movies, even the terrible ones. <laughs> no, Duncan! I knew you for like three seconds. Rip away. This is like motion sickness the fucking game, isn't it? These the way you swing stars is gross. Level burglar. Yeah, it's just the one level, thankfully. It's pretty expensive. I wanna try and save up for the mana regen. You've not seen Alien? Oh, you're in for a treat. In for a treat. <clears throat> no, Duncan. Ah, uh, well, he was quite a survivor. <laughs> Jesus. Do I have anything to help here? Probably not. Yeah, I didn't know, I didn't know, um, Metro was ins Aliens ins uh, inspired Metro. It's really cool. I've not played Metro, so. Oh, I mean, when I was a kid. This was but oh god yeah that was like one of one of if not the first movie series is a like a female protagonist right it was a bit of a sausage fest up until that point i mean it still is a bit of a sausage fest let's be honest but it does oh that's cool i was i saw the, the newest predator it's really good i really liked it All the swords they've got a too high level for me. Just gonna have to really. The, the original's the best. Um, the rest aren't very good. In fact, I... I tried to watch the second one, the second Predator movie. And... 
I just couldn't concentrate on it. It just couldn't, didn't hold my attention. The first one though, that's great. Love that one. It's dumb as hell, but. Get to the chopper. Come on. <laughs> I can't not like it. Oops, sorry, Duncan. No. It keeps crashing. Do you want me to kill myself? All the native. Oh, are they? Oh, that's cool. They did really well with that. That's um. Uh, the predator. Is it called? It's called prey, isn't it? Which made. Um. Excuse me. Looking for the prey game a little bit difficult. Uh, I'll be back in a sec. I'm stuck in the bathroom. Um, oops, wrong one. <laughs> Airing out my dirty laundry. <laughs> he hasn't seen the Princess Bride. Murder him. I'll take it, it's fine. I deserve it. Horror movies. No, I'm not a big fan either. I, I have to really like the story if I'm going to watch a horror movie. Or if it's just not scary. I like the Conjuring movies, but they're fucking... I'm not a I'm big scaredy baby. I can't watch them by myself. No! Duncan! Oh, well, he was quite a survivor. Where's my rope bow?
What are you doing on me? <laughs> yes, I've seen all of... Um, I've seen men in tights. Probably more than... More than the average person. I've watched that a lot. Same with space balls. I've watched a lot of Mel Brooks stuff. Daggers of Frost. Blazing Saddles. Have I seen that one? No, I don't think I've seen that one. Is Mel Brooks still alive? <laughs> Oh my god, he's 96 years old. Oh my god. Spaceballs was made in 1987. Men in Tights was 1993. Okay, that's... That's... I was going to say, I don't remember that one being that old. I've, oh, I haven't really seen much of his stuff then. Got away with it in the 70s. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of those. Um, like, Monty Python is the classic example. You couldn't get, you, you wouldn't get away with that stuff now. What is wrong with my dipshit of a character? Looks like. Does it really? Holy shit. In the 70s? Jeez. Although I suppose that's probably when the word was being used most <laughs> in a very not great light. It pushes me off. As a total idiot. Oh, well. <laughs> Just like real life. Daggers of Frost. Where did they just end up? Oh, I already have them. Oh, shit. I threw away my poison bow, too, didn't I? Jesus. He's pretty prolific. Like, he's been in the the game for a long time. Has he stopped making stuff now? Or is he just one of those people that's going to go until he drops? Stay still, you fuckers. Hey, Julie, how you doing? I'm alright, I'm exhausted, but we're doing alright. <laughs>
True, yeah. He did do a lot of, like, he, he acted in a lot of them until a certain point too, didn't he? And if you haven't seen Spaceballs, oh, great film. This is a bit weird, <laughs> but it's good. True, yeah, and I mean, if he's, if, like, it's, which I assume it is for him, like, a true life passion, then, no, uh, no reason to stop it, I guess. If I had more mana potions, I've only got four, I'd be throwing fireballs or something. Angela Lansbury? Oh, I hate to do it to you, but I don't recognize the name. I'm not good with names. Voices I can do, I'm pretty pretty good at. Names. And faces, not so much. Network Capital 11. <laughs> that, yeah. Best snaps. The best snaps are the ones that go into the double digits. Oh fuck. That's close. I really hope we don't have to deal with this many of them again. This is ridiculous. You know, <laughs> you're not not that old. room to kind of <laughs> you know it's you know it's early when when even your dog is like no I, I need I need a couple more hours I don't actually know if this does more damage than those arrows. It definitely really does. Fuck me. That's more than, that's half my mana, just for one. Do I have anything else ranged? No. Oh, and there's three more. <laughs> what are these things? Rabbits? Let's see. Mass effect. Oh, God, I wish. I think with telekinesis, you can pick them up, actually. the way this guy holds these. Slopes. But yeah. They, actually, these things are probably the hardest to kick, too. They don't really react the way you'd think. They kind of just stumble. Which is, I, I don't know how I'm supposed, how you're supposed to, like,
get the definite kick because there are spikes here. Okay. But we run out of mana very quickly. Mana? Um, stamina. It seems very random when you kick and when you just kind of unlikely br brush with your with the dogs. Where are they coming from? This is fucking ridiculous. Can they just dodge it? Here comes another one. From somewhere. Another two, actually. Kill me! So actually, who murder she wrote? Oh my god, hang on. It's an Angela Lansbury. Oh, I know her. I didn't know she died. That's fucking depressing. Oh man. That one, I didn't even see that on. Usually that sort of stuff pops up on my feed on stuff. No, we'll have to kill them all because they're very quick and they'll they chase you forever. Um. And they're very strong. Murder She Wrote. It's a, it's a different show. I, I've seen a few episodes. I'm not too big into it. Oops. Please tell me that's it. Too. Oh, nice. Such a good boy. She was a good singer. I had no idea. It's quite if <laughs> you yeah. What are you trying to say, Canada? Saying my skills are subpar. I'll have to agree with you there, I think. God, is the way to get out of here through here? Oh my god, it is. We could have just run away. Well, shit. rusted my armor from the inside out. That's gross. They're different evil, <laughs> I guess. Go you would think as as like the Antichrist you have some some ah! food with the other the other evil groups, but I guess not. Although Aaron Tier, the evil guy, is actively trying to stop us, so Maybe he doesn't want the competition. You'll pay when I get my hands on you. Oh, that was close. 
I damn near wrecked the mother from the inside out. Die! I actually look like a bit like the Nosferatu from Vampire Masquerade. And they're wearing a thong. <laughs> Not to my sword. Oh, a secret. Not really much of a secret. That's great, the archer. <laughs> janky as anything. Uh, they run on the same engine, I think, so that's probably why. Star's supposed to have longer reach, but... Ah! Uh, back then? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. They didn't hold your hand as much. That's for sure. But, I mean, I haven't got any weapons that would make this easier on me either. The game doesn't really want you to play as a magic user. <laughs> Fucking quick. Yeah, well, probably a good idea. Oh my god, he actually killed something. Congratulations, you aren't completely shit at your job. Just mostly. <laughs> Three skill points so I can get the manager regen thing. Hey King Corbo, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Probably best you dodge that attack. Yeah. <laughs> Well, you say that. Um, usually it is best to avoid sharp claws and or swords.
These things are like fucking cockroaches. Two hits. Two fucking hits. Fun games are fun. <laughs> so fun. Oh. Is there more? Like, is there another wizard's armor that I can get? That's a weird one. Don't dot. Thing is, I need to. I need mana. I have three potions left, and that is not enough. Ah! Yeah, the staves aren't the ideal choice for these guys. They're so quick. <laughs> Thanks for the bits, Juliet. It really is. The shame is so unpredictable. Fuck. Thanks. It worked. See, we killed it. Uh. What? Oh, hello. Bow of fiery rage. Hey, you must be Saren. Yes. And you'd be Percy? Can you lead me to the necropolis? Oh, sure. Through the aqueducts. I used to work on the aqueducts. There's a path through the flow path. All music to listen to. How do we get there? How? Tell me quickly. Oh, nice. Come on. So forceful. <laughs> There's a cyclops sitting right across the path. Oh, of course there is. Get me to the valve control house and I'll get you inside. <laughs> That's alright, that's what it's there for. Slowly make my way through it. I'll take care of them. Save your strength for Aaron here. Oh, one more point. One more point. So why did I bother with this shit then? Can I refund some of these fucking points? Oh, we're taking a shortcut. That's not a, the most irritating noise in the world at all. Really? One potion? True. Yeah. to make sure Percy stays alive, don't I? That felt good. <laughs> if I can kill this thing, that'll be the points that I need. How'd I get that's not Percy, is it? the bow. Yeah, this is an undead one. But hopefully, even if it just gives us one point, we'll be fine.
They're not too tough, I don't think. As long as you hit him in the eyeball. There we go. Keep walking over here. Can I, is there a window we can look out of? Nope. <laughs> Here he is. You'll be really handy. Another one of those ballista we had before. Or balliste, however you want to say it. can't zoom in with this and they just bounce off good although he's undead so fire should work but okay The world's most anticlimactic battle ever. Are we supposed to go down? I guess we probably are. Get a little bit closer. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, I mean, enough health. Great job. Now let's go. Ugh, that thing smells like dead meat. Of course, oh my it's God. dead. It serves errand here. Now aim for the eyes. Oh my God! I don't know if that was worth twelve points. <laughs> Big boy. And I'm pretty certain one shot is, you know, ripperoni. So. Oh god. Uh oh. Fuck me. Out of all the places he could have thrown at me. Smells like dead meat. Of course, it's dead. It serves errand here. Now aim for the eye. Doesn't really 
really seem to do anything. Yeah. A useless. Yeah, I don't know why he does that. I, I can't pick them up. Unless you go, like, super adrenaline mode. He's got to be getting close by now. Now I see why this was optional. Fucking hell. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, and this spell is shit. Um, the spells in general do so little damage. It doesn't really tell you how much damage they do, so you kind of just have to gauge it off how... The only gauge is how quickly the enemies drop, which is not very quickly at all. This could be, this could be doing one damage per fireball, for all I know. And the only place you can hit it is in the eyeball, so it's... I don't think that does any damage. Where's Percy? <laughs> he's just he's just gone. I don't blame him. I'm already trapped with oh god.
Oh my god. You ain't learned shit, whatever your name is. I've actually forgotten our main character's name. Goober. I didn't get any points for that. Good. Uh, that was such a useful, useful, useful thing. Good. So what was the point for that then? I think we're supposed to go down. Yeah, this is where we came from. So are we just supposed to go? Oh. Well, as much as I'd love to continue being trampled over and over again, uh, we're going to leave it there tonight. Oh my god. Uh, and tomorrow night we will play some more Greedfall. And what is it tomorrow, Wednesday? The fuck is Wednesday already? Thursday we might give um, Mel Goose Solid another try. And then on Friday, we're going to make some brownies. And I got another package that we're going to set up uh, after it. Um, and then we'll play something. <laughs> I don't know what. We'll figure something out. Um, depending on how long that takes, though. We might just do the um, surprise package. Kind of. I, I ordered it. Um, then it got here yesterday. You know how to bake? I do, yeah. Remember Fable? Yes, we will. We may we might do Fable on Friday then. Um Yeah, get all them running. Uh I do know how to bake, yeah. I make pretty good brownies. I haven't made anything in a while. Got a tray yet? No, I haven't. So I'm gonna go shopping on Friday and fingers crossed I can find some trays. Because I can't, um, I can't make brownies in that, that tray I've got. And that was the only one there, so. It was quite fun. Fable is my favourite game series probably of all time. I would say. This, uh, factoring in nostalgia and stuff. Easily. Oh, uh, Fable is my favourite. It's PC. Yeah, I can, I know Fable 3 was, um, released on PC, but I don't even know if you can buy it uh, now. PC and emulation doesn't work. Fable 2. Yeah, I've heard Fable 2 has been a real pain in the ass to try and get to emulate. Um, I've still got my ancient Xbox 360 that's like on the verge of death. <laughs> so I'm holding on to that thing so I can still play Fable by a system yeah i mean i don't even see xbox 360s that cheap these days either which is a bit annoying um but it would make it a lot easier if it was just on pc i don't know why they haven't done it i don't know why skip skip one go straight from fable one to fable three that doesn't make any sense but yeah we'll, we'll do 
we'll do the remastered. I have both. No. No. There's DLC. Oh, yeah. Heroes and Villains content patch. 21 bucks. Yeah, no thanks. Cause are rare and rare. Yeah, I heard there was some sort of like um connectivity thing where if you connected your Xbox 360 to the internet, some of the updates increase the risk of red rings. So I've that, that thing hasn't been connected to the internet for god knows how long. Oops. Cause they're awful. <laughs> oh my god. Waluigi is great child. Nice. Two is bad ones. Yeah. I don't know. Back, uh, Fable was a, a Hallmark franchise, so it's probably backwards compatible, I would say. My tag. Anyway, yeah, we might, we'll play that on, on Friday. Because we've got lots of time. And. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't think it'd be in the actual session. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like that. Good job. That's not going to last long on the elbow there, but good job. You need that. <laughs> oh, I, I bet it's probably pretty painful on like that little... The joint. Oh my god. Oh, that's so cool. Anyway. Break. <laughs> Just a little bang. <laughs> nitrogen infused Pepsi. What? What does nitrogen even do for soda? Anniversary icons. Ooh. Saving that. <laughs> Smaller bubbles and creamy texture. Oh. Okay. Aren't they though? I really like these. I might steal some and use them for emotes. Joking. Possibly. Look at these though. These are really cool. A lot of these are just ingrained into my memory too. A lot higher res than I used to see though. <laughs> oh, the classic fart one. Lovely. Anyway, yeah, that's the plan. Um, brownies put stuff together and this. Um, and we'll just kind of mix and match the games through the week. Um, but yeah, we'll leave, we'll leave Metal Gear Solid on to Thursday because if I get the shits, then we can just swap it over to another game, uh, which I am foreseeing um, because that game is very frustrating. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for the biddies, Juliet. Appreciate it. So uh, enjoy the rest of your day or night, whichever it is. Uh, stay safe, and I will see you tomorrow for whatever we're going to play tomorrow, whatever I said 30 seconds ago. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> Uh-oh, my button stopped working again.